A snowy day in the Russian capital. The first heavy snowfall of the year arrived just in time for the festive season. The Russian New Year holiday ends on the 12th of January. Russians stock up food and drink during the long holiday period. But this year they are worried. Prices of certain food items like fish and beef have gone up by more than 40%. These people are putting a brave face on it, at least for the time being. We're worried, not afraid, but worried that our pensions won't be enough to buy all we need. I don't see a point in panicking or worrying. We'll get all the food we need now until the end of the holidays. The economy has been battered by falling global oil prices and Western sanctions over Russia's role in Ukraine. The ruble has been losing its value. And the economy is set to enter recession next year for the first time in six years. President Putin wants his colleagues to be prepared during this holiday season. The holidays are quite long and people have their right to relax. We have a long and depressing autumn and winter period, so holidays never hurt. But for the government, for your agencies, we cannot afford this long holiday, at least not this year. Mr. Putin wants to show that he is in charge and tackling the faltering economy. He is confident the crisis will be over in two years. Much depends on oil prices and any future sanctions by the West. Anbaras Nithirajan, BBC News.